All right, so when we bought the Trail Boss, one of the options I didn't get was the protection package. So what that means is I didn't get a bed liner, and as what you can see here is we're missing something that I think is pretty important. And uh, it looks pretty terrible, and it's unprotected, and it's just bad. And we're going to fix that today. So what we're going to add are some wheel wall liners here. This particular one's from Husky. Uh, you can get these from a couple different places. Realtruck.com has it. I think I got these from Amazon. I'll leave that link in the description. And we're going to turn that, what we just saw, we did this side already, into that. Looks way nicer, a lot cleaner, and a lot more protected. So when you go to put these on, you'll notice there's uh, some lettering here. This one's DS for driver's side, the other one's passenger side. Just uh, consider putting these on on the right side, and the reason for that is these holes, which will become a little bit more important later, will line up correctly. All right, so one thing you'll note is we got a mud flap on here already. This might be a little bit easier if we don't have the flap on there, but we'll be able to make it work on the other side. And really, it's just a matter of Taking it and literally stuffing it in there. It takes a little bit of persuasion, but nothing uh, too hard. We're going to do this side first because it's got the WeatherTech mud flap in there already. Say with this side, the mud flap that comes with the truck, you got to get it tucked behind there. It'll take uh, a little bit of bending, it's pretty pliable, but it still takes a little bit of persuasion. <clears throat> and basically, get this all tucked up in here. <clears throat> Just like that and then when you're done with it you should be able to just lift ever so slightly and see these attachment points here we'll put some hardware that came with it and we'll button this all the way in so in this particular install take these little guys here they come with some washers because I don't have any other type of hardware here I didn't take off a wheel liner to put this one on it just literally just pops in there like that. Push it in there, make sure you get all the clicks. There's just little threads on this that uh, literally just grab these little holes that are here. And you'll hear that audible click when you push it in. A couple here on the side. This one's nice and lined up, nice and easy. Well, there's a trick you can pull from behind a little bit to get it to line up some. There it goes, all the way in. And there you have it, and that's what she looks like. 